media conference call in connection with a uh, most irresponsible, seditious uh, political spin, which is now a very current uh, a term used after the social media convention speech by the Deputy Udusan editor. The spin against the opposition is okay. This is uh, a one example without why it is not okay. This is the Selengo, Selengo Kita. Selengo Kita. It, uh, there's no identification of who printed or published. Because under the law, you have to say printed and published by who is not there. But there is a, a number, PP13820, 032012, purportedly to be a license, license issued by the Ministry of Home Affairs for the publication. True, not true, I do not know. But on page two of this uh, May 2012 issue, Selengo Kita, Mata dan Telinga Rakyat, you have this uh, page two big red box, which is uh, most uh, a total downright lies and falsehood, which says, Comment Lim Kit Siang terhadap agong kita. Sumber DAP. Lim Kit Siang dalam komen niya berkata raja-raja Melayu, semua niya lanun, semua niya perumpak, kata Lim Kit Siang lagi. Buat apa hormat agong? Buat habis wang ringgit cukai rakyat. Sahaja beri Pada Raja Raja Melayu. This is the most irresponsible, seditious, insightful, because it is aimed at uh, creating uh, racial uh, distrust, ill will, creating the impression that the DAP or I am against the Sultanate, uh, Malay Sultanate system, against, uh, I have no respect for the Antipatan Agong, for the Malay rulers. This is completely untrue. There is no basis. I've never said any such thing. And uh, this is uh, uh, seditious as well. It's against the Sedition Act because it's likely to create ill will against the, the system uh, of the Malay rulers in the country. And uh, it's an example of how sick the political system has become with the uh, uh, general election approaching. All sorts of lies and falsehoods are, are being spread. And uh, this must be condemned in no uncertain terms. And uh, uh, Wing Zan, he will be lodging a police report so that uh, such lies and falsehoods must not be allowed any room uh, for currency. And we hope that the authorities will take immediate action. And uh, what's most important is our call on all political parties to maintain high ethical standards. We have political differences. But that doesn't mean we should tell lies, falsehoods, uh, to, to, in order to create racial ill will, hatred, suspicion, mistrust among the races, among Malaysians, against each other. And uh, this is something that must be stopped if uh, we are going to have an honest, uh, fair and just uh, uh, elections. And that's why one of the eight demands of Brse. Uh, is to demand to have uh, uh, clean elections and sort dirty politics. This is uh, one of the dirty politics uh, of its worst kind. Uh, I received a copy of this newspaper, the original copy is here, uh, yesterday from uh, members of the public from Puchong. Um, of course, as what uh, YB Lim said just now, the uh, <coughs> article or the statement published in page two of this newspaper is highly seditious and, uh, and uh, defamatory. Uh, I will launch a report, a police report. I will launch a police report uh, later today uh, to demand the uh, Royal Malaysian Police to investigate into this matter. Uh, particularly, I also want the police to investigate the validity of the uh, Propagation permit uh, PP one three eight two zero slash zero three slash two two zero one two. 
if there is a valid, if this is a valid police permit, uh, publication permit, and if it is so, uh, we want the police to investigate and to take out the uh, the owner of this publication. Uh, I also believe that uh, this action uh, of uh, publishing uh, publishing lies falsehood is also an offence under Section Five Hundred One Penal Code. criminal defamation uh, because the statement or the propagation is actually defaming uh, Mr. Lim's credibility as a politician and uh, this is not the first time um, Selangor Kita uh, was published this newspaper has been around since about two years ago uh, I managed to have uh, publications and all publications Exposed by our former, our Hulu Langat past MP, Dr. Che Rosli, about two years ago, he found this newspaper, same newspaper, Slango Kita, circulated and distributed during a Maulitu Rasu event in Slango Shalam. That was two years ago. So it's very clear to us that these publications is intended to defame Pakatan Rakyat and DAP. This is actually the latest in a series of lies that have been told against myself, against the DAP. And of course, among the lies have been that the DAP is uh, anti-Malay, anti-Islam, that the DAP wants to have a Christian uh, Prime Minister, wants to uh, create a Christian Malaysia, DAP wants to uh, have a republic, Konga Kok want to abolish the Malay uh, uh, Sultan system, which are completely untrue, because the DAP has read from the beginning, make it very clear that we fully supported, as in the Pakatan Rakyat Common uh, uh, Platform uh, Program, that the three parties of Pakatan Rakyat we fully support the fundamental features of the Constitution, one of which is to uphold the system of uh, uh, monarchy. So our position, our support, our full uh, allegiance to the monarch monarchical system is uh, cannot be disputed. But then you have, you have all these lies and falsehoods which are being spread to create a, a racial mistrust, racial suspicion and uh, uh, racial hatred uh, because elections are around the corner. And this is uh, dirty politics as its worst, irresponsible. Uh, regardless of consequence, how it will uh, divide uh, the country, it will, it, it will uh, uh, cause uh, a division, a discord, a disunity, and uh, it must be condemned uh, in the strongest terms. And I call on the Prime Minister and all AMNO BN leaders to take a stand to condemn uh, this type of uh, reckless, irresponsible, unprincipled politics. Malaysia Kini.com For the Malaysia Kini For the Malaysia Kini, Malaysia Kini